it is a very definite process uh, and one that's quite unexpected when you receive that diagnosis. Even in our case, we, we very much knew what was coming. You know, we had sort of eight weeks of assessment, but we'd already seen the regression and we'd already seen the lack of development with Jesse. So although we knew the diagnosis before they officially told us and before it was written down, it's still a huge shock. Um, and there's a lot of sort of anger, grief. There's a, a, an acceptance that you have to come to um, and in our case that acceptance has taken a good couple of years before you reach the point that your life is very different from the life you thought you was going to have but that's okay, it doesn't make it a bad thing, there are challenges but you can get through it, you know, we, we have lived the last two and a half years, it hasn't beaten us, it hasn't beaten the kids, we're still here. Take things one step at a time, one day at a time. Don't try and achieve everything within the first month of, of getting the diagnosis. Um, come to terms with it and accept those emotions that, that it brings out. Once you can start to see the good in the situation and not just the negative, and it is very hard to do that. Um, meltdowns are very difficult to work through, lack of communication can be very, very heartbreaking for a lot of parents. Both of our children were non-verbal. Now they're starting to develop small bits of communication and it's about taking immense joy in those moments of watching Jessie in front of her mirror doing her Makaton signs and, you know, and just sort of having, um, having pleasure in the small things. And once you start to focus on that instead of the negative, things do become easier. You don't think they're going to when you first reach the diagnosis. You can start to have a relatively normal life. Life can be good and life will be good. The challenges can be overcome. Nothing is too big to face. Go with your children, go with the autism, don't fight against it. Turn to other people for help and advice, be that professionals, charities, local authorities, other parents, internet, forums, reach out to other people. Um, when you come to the acceptance of it, it will be okay. Mm -hmm.